Thank you. Ready. Thank you. Great kick serve, worthy of a final, all this stuff. You're not going to see better tennis than this for the next seven days. Somebody has to lose it. Two all. Missed it. Three, two, Isner. Isner edges out in front. One more point before the players switch ends. And Roddick going for everything. He played that safely, that backhand, and uh, just backed himself at Thank the you. net. Isner, that tall frame there. Roddick went for a little too much. Missed it wide. Takes command, 4-2. Yeah, quite incredible on that one because it was Roddick that made the first move here. Played that one safely, a short ball. Roddick decides to go in, but again, the approach shot too far inside the quarters, not close to the sideline, and he threads the needle. And he's the one that's taken all the risks, isn't it? And boy, does he want this 4-2 now? A big ask for Roddick. Mini break goes the way of the 6-10. John Isner, his 89th winner. Two 52 errors. Roddick with still one serve left to try to close that gap. And does so effectively, but the mini break puts Isner out in front, 4-3. Two serves on his racket. Well, the difference in this tie break has been one passing shot. Been absolutely blistering serves. And one passing shot. That's all it might take. Mm -hmm. A 
Again, a brilliant play from Isner. Took the risk. Serve and volley on a second serve. And he had to make a good volley. John Isner's best performance at a major was his first ever here at the 2007 U.S. Open. Lost in this round, the third round. Went 0 for 5 in his next majors. He's two points away from eliminating the five seed to get to the round of 16. Boy, that volley caught the back edge of the line. And then he had to come up again with another one. Isner had a match point in the 10th game of the fourth set. Roddick pushed it aside to force this fifth set. Isner with match point number two. Isner thought that it may have been a let. He asked Steve Ulrich if he heard a let. Ulrich's reply was negative. Match point number three for Isner. He heard the net on that occasion. Roddick didn't hear that one. He didn't want to hear that one. If he did, he wants to ignore it and block it out and put it away. He'll have to offer up. Another serve. And does so with authority. His 20th ace of the match. Well, Isner has been backing himself, and this was his opportunity. It hadn't looked like breaking Roddick's serve. He's backed himself all night on his own serve. He served 38 aces. It comes down to this. Crowd before this even gets going, the crowd are on their feet. Look at it, what an atmosphere. Now they know they've seen a tennis match at the highest level in just the third round, but it has been masterful. It has been intense. And John Isner with his fourth chance to eliminate Andy Roddick. Oh, and he does it. Well, you see the respect from John Isner as he gets up off the ground after he fell in disbelief and outlasting fellow American Andy Roddick. But now he can emerge and head to the center of the court triumphant.